Truck drivers, what is the craziest thing you have seen, looking down into passenger vehicles? There was a dude playing the violin while driving in rush hour traffic. So many people hitting a bowl and even rolling joints while driving. Women doing their makeup at 80 miles per hour. 60 plus year old man reading the newspaper on the steering wheel. Guy in a beat to shit minivan with a massive pig in the rear. Like at least 300 pounds. Man on motorcycle with dog in backpack. Young boy in the backseat with a tablet on corn hub. My friend was a truck driver. He said once he was in a traffic jam, so he was looking around, and the guy next to him was jerking off. What's even crazier, he said the guy waved at him with his other hand. Saw a lady reading a book. At night. With a flashlight. By laying it on the steering wheel. While doing 70 miles per hour on the highway. Lady in the car ahead of me kept looking down at the seat beside her, literally every 10 seconds or so. I was thinking, geez, how often do you need to check that map? This was way before cell phones, she pulled into the right lane to get on the expressway, and as I pulled up on her left and glanced over, I realized she was knitting. Needle in each hand as she, loosely, held the wheel, paper pattern lying on the seat. Not a truck driver, but once saw a dude playing the trumpet while driving. Not a euphemism. Actually playing an instrument. Wasn't that I saw in a car but this guy drove headlong into the semi in front of him. Intentionally. Didn't try to swerve wasn't distracted, clearly paying attention and angry looking. Still confused how that was supposed to play out in his head. I was on the second floor of a double-decker bus and saw a goat in someone's living room through their window, you didn't ask me but I have nowhere else to share that. According to my husband, lot of naked women, dudes jerking off, and road head. The best is parents teaching their little kids the arm pump to get trucks to honk. Was driving, passed a car and had to do a double-take. Four colleges aged guys all wearing onesies, and either had a pacifier or bottle in their mouths. And it looked like they were wearing diapers too. I was like, ha. Huh, there's something you don't see every day. While driving an old pickup truck past me, the guy was getting a blowjob, a few miles down the road at the next exit. They both were out of the pickup and the lady was throwing up. I remember a similar question was posted before and the truck driver mentioned seeing somebody hit like a four foot long bong from the driver's seat. The best part is that the guy who was smoking out of it responded to the truck driver on Reddit and provided some kind of proof to show it was him, can't remember what, but I'm assuming it was a pick of the bong. Passenger recording people in the back seat having sex. A duck with a seat belt on. Someone grilling what appeared to be hot dogs in a minivan. Passengers hitting the driver. I saw a woman in a convertible scratching like she had an ant nest in her knickers. We were stopped at lights. She stopped and really slowly looked up at me. I just smiled at her. I'm sure that was the longest wait at a red light in the history of traffic lights. I was driving a box truck into Pittsburgh a few months ago and I was in the passenger lane, and this SUV comes flying up in the left lane, but then hovers right next to me. After a few seconds, I figured he must be trying to flip me off or something, and thought I must have cut him off or something. But no. I looked down and the driver locked eyes with me and I noticed he had his dick in his hand, and he was masturbating. Once he was satisfied that I had seen his dick, he sped off. FYI I'm also a male. Been driving truck for 10 years. When I got my license I'd hear guys tell all the stories of how many women have flashed them. Let me tell you in the last 10 years I've seen exactly zero titties while driving. So I've decided that either other truck drivers are full of shit, women aren't as wild as they used to be, or I don't pay enough attention. I asked a guy once about this and he told me it happens more on the west coast. If that's true then it makes me wonder why West Coast women are wilder than East Coast women. I saw someone writing a manual letter while eating a sandwich. Drove with his knee. Don't know how the heel he stayed in a lane. Been flashed by college girls in a Jeep, watched a guy get blown in his new car for 30 miles, watched a young woman in traffic with one foot on the dash, her skirt around her chest and trying to rub the hair off it in the fast lane. Yeah, people do shit in cars all the time. Riding shotgun helping buddy relocate in a big rental truck. It's dark. We're talking about the nuts and bolts of obscure welfare programs, his job. We somehow catch up with a small beater car and he starts to pass it. I look down to see who's driving slower than a rental truck on an interstate. Dome light come on and two hotties are shaking there, ample, bosoms at me and doing. Other things. I say, Ed, there are two naked women in the car we're passing which he took to mean I was bored with government entitlements and said, whatever. 
Well I went back to watching them and another minute went by until car went suddenly dark and they sped away. It was ages later that someone told me they were soliciting, or luring us away so they could rob us. My personal favorite was a man in a nice dress shirt, and tie who was not wearing pants, eating cereal out of a large Tupperware container. My theory is he didn't want to spill milk on his pants while driving. Driving a box truck, looked over at a red light and saw a chick vigorously masturbating with, what was at that time the biggest dildo I'd ever seen. She noticed me noticing and winked at me before driving off, when the light went green. Driving a wagon, on a Sunday afternoon, on a motorway. Looked down to see a nice long pair of legs, clad in stockings, which led to a black miniskirt, legs akimbo, purple panties on display. Took all my willpower to keep an eye on the road ahead. Looked down twice more, getting a bit of a lazy lob on. Took a look up then decided for one last look down. To see a hand slip down the skirt and gently grip one edge of the panties, pull slightly to one side. And the biggest cock I've ever seen in real life flopped out. Edit, my most upvoted comment is about some sly motorway cockage. You Redditors amaze me. Tour bus driver, saw a dude in a full gimp suit tied to the passenger seat in a passing car once. Also, I'd get cars falling in beside me to catch a few minutes of the onboard movie, you could see them staring up into the bus windows. Or maybe they were trying to snag some free Wi-Fi off the bus. A former co-worker was a truck driver at one point. He said he once saw some guy shaving while driving in a convertible. He emphasized that the driver had slathered his face in shaving cream and was using a regular Gillette or whatever the F blade with a big bowl of water right beside him in the passenger seat. In poorer neighborhoods it always amazed me how many infants were just laying down in the back seat with no car seat. The other things was how many people would drink alcohol while driving. The usual half-naked people, all kinds of eating foods, even a guy on a Harley steering with his feet while leaning back against the passenger backrest. Never seen anyone having sex, but most of my runs were early morning and very rural western states. I drove a bigger truck, box in Jacksonville, Florida. For a couple years. Almost all the craziest shit I've seen is in cop cars. By the cop. Two times saw a cop with a bag of weed, obviously not evidence. One was kinda rummaging into it, as I would, were I about to stuff some of it into something to smoke. I suppose it could been official. The other one was just kinda smelling it and looking at it at the red light. Again, not saying they lit up, it was just a really weird scene. To be fair I'm not 100% sure how cops handle evidence weed. Maybe they are supposed to work with it while driving with the other hand. I have seen masturbation, by both sexes, the first time I commented on it my passenger, older real truck driver, told me he probably saw that more than anything else in his however many years of driving. Not a truck driver but once saw a man drive by going to town on a pacifier. Like the thing babies use. I've never seen a baby use one that enthusiastically. Told my dad about it and he said it was a drugs thing. Like? I used to work in an addiction clinic and never heard of that. Saw this one lady reach into her crotch, rummage around in there, then pulled her hand out and smelled it. Judging by her reaction, it probably stunk, but it seemed like she was into it. I was just like. I wasn't in a truck, but I was at a red light and a car pulled up next to me. A woman is driving and I look over, and I at first thought, she was just passionately kissing the guy in the passenger seat. And then I saw she was hysterically crying. Guy had overdosed and she was trying to get him to the hospital, and she was trying to give him CPR while at the light. He was dead already though, I work at the hospital she was driving to. Not a driver anymore, but I've put down a few miles. The only things really come to mind, was some people bumping uglies, couple people playing with themselves solo, unmarked armored convoy, people doing drugs. Probably others, but I've got a shit memory and didn't pay that much attention to internal goings on of most four wheelers. Not a truck driver, but as an observant passenger I saw a dude flossing his teeth with both of his hands while looking in the mirror going 70 miles per hour. Still baffles me. Not a truck driver, but did see someone steering with their teeth one time. Like, clenched teeth around the top of the wheel. Thank you for watching, Reddit Stories. May you and your loved ones have a blessed day.